You remember the, the former you remember the former intelligence man who was killed in Moshi and they called him Wajambazi. Those those <laughs> things deep ground is things of oppression and cheating. They killed themselves through their corruptions. If you have cheated somebody in the time of the problem, that is how problem faces. We can't we cannot leave any storm without time up and seeing what is going on there and what has happened. We understand it. So it's not the government which killed. No, it's the government. If you have eaten in somebody's money, then you could not do what he told you. The answer is that. Because he knows your boss knows where he can take you. Now those So in Tanzania you allow those things to happen if you have eaten we some money. Allow, is why we try to <laughs> you know, those who are employed to do that work, we arrested them and they are in for that. Some of them took ten years, some of them fifteen years, some of them life. But some people are saying that the man holds a very, very secret a government secrets, and that's why the, the government uh, tried to finish him. Not try, but it, it finished him. Now, if you are a government responsible, you know what is going to the government on, and you are the one he trusted you, you are second to so and so, and you try to betray a government that is not cheating, that you are rebel. Rebel answer is there. I say that one, forget that one. But this one of this is his with his opponent, with his friend in business. It's what he brought to that head. But CCM know, knows how to make propaganda, knows how to defend themselves. Uh, is this not the same the same thing you are doing here, Mr. Sangi? I'm neutral. I'm neutral. Oh, you're neutral. I'm okay. neutral. Okay. I cannot defend the system itself. I can defend in Kenya. I'm already told you, Kenya has gone very high, very fine education. I told you. Uh -huh. I'm not Kenyan. Why am I to defend them? Because they have done things which appear to be good. Okay. The okay. same way I hated them. Our Kenya is half are totally primitive, totally poor, and half are well, welfare, rich, and educated. Now, this is two division. In Tanzania, we don't have a very big gap from those lower classes. Poor they are there, but they are not very far. They have got their houses, they have got their lands, but here there is somebody who don't have it in anywhere to stay. Mr. Msangi, the time is giving us a not good sign, but uh, let me give you the chance to finish uh, by telling us what should be done so that East African can start working? Uh, in East Africa, people who came, who those overseas, analyzes of politics, they have to sit down to see problem of Kenya, problem of Tanzania, problem of Rwanda, problem of Burundi, problem of Uganda. That's so people when they sit down and they see their problem, they can't bring so much problem to this community. For example, people they are coward and some of them they think about money. They can't tell Kagame, this is the peace region. Move from Rwanda, come in here, we work together. Mm -hmm. From Congo, come inside Rwanda, work together. They can't tell him, is he fighting against Congolese, is he killing Congolese? 
Uganda, Museven is killing those northern people. You don't tell if these regions we are making community, we have to be free and peaceful region. Leave those people. Come to the table, we give five years, talk and finish it. In Kenya here, is the best of rebellion Somali are here, are doing everything bad. You can see somebody came yesterday, today have got an identity card. He can buy it for 500,000. Doesn't matter, provided he being called Kenyan. And the problem of Kenya, those primitives who are around outside of Kenya, northern eastern, down there up to Uganda, then you haven't finished it to think education of Kormoy, think education of Pokoto, think education of Turkana, think education of Buru, think education of uh, Purana. No, you have more people, even though they are rich, but they are not educated. And you see Somali, they are not fighting because they are what and what, because of primitive, the illiterate, very few Somali who are educated. And it's also Somali who are educated, they are already running, they are outside of the country. They are many there, primitive, illiterate. They don't know cause of arms. They hunt each other. No educated men can say, my clan must rule. What is that? What should you what is that? My clan must rule. Awieni can in can say me awieni I must rule. Dogodia I my a dogodia must rule. Manjel say I must rule. Dor must rule. Abugale I must rule. Now how, what the country of that? Those comes because of primitivity. Like last time when my friend here said that now whatever happened, let it happen. Come to the search out. They sit in ten people. They did what they did. Then people of Kenya familiar, they are familiar. If to after election they rest three days, they call all over the world, people to come and enjoy their victory. Now the same time 11 hours, they completed, the, about 5 years, 5 they completed the at one ready, president, with a blanket on it. No one can accuse him. No one can talk on him. He is the president of the state, leader of the state. Now, my friend, the people came to fight because of that. How can it be? Even the one failure can he say that I won. Don't you see? Otherwise, we don't do. Don't you see now? Has done it. Uh, they have robbed from me. They have taken our victory. Now, people, they can fight it because of that. And also, when they, ex they explain it, it, it comes very clear. They say that it's those who fought after election. <laughs> those who fought after election. They don't say those who fought before election. No, they say those who. Kabisa, Siwarudishe, Madara Kani Kabisa, Siwarudishe, Madara Kani Kabisa.